everyone, it's Ross. In today's video, I'm gonna just give you guys a little bit of a reminder. Um, what I'm doing today is coming out here to the storage area to water some of the fig trees. Um, you know, it's that time of the year that you basically have to just give them a little bit of water. I'd say just really only a, a cup, a half a cup, really depends on the size. Something this small here, which is only a one gallon, I'm gonna barely give it some water. That's it. You know, um, it's just a little safety precaution. Um, definitely something you should pay attention to. For me, I have a lot of them that are mulched and I don't really have to worry about it. Um, I've gone years now where I didn't water a single tree in my storage areas and I came out okay. Now, last year we had a little bit of a problem because we blasted the the heater in the greenhouse really early. The trees were stacked quite high, as I'm gonna show you guys in just a second. So we couldn't really get in here and water all these trees. Um, but what was happening was that the heater was in this corner here, sending out heat in this direction, and anything in this little area was getting blasted by the heat, it was drying out, desiccating, it's a similar thing with the heater we have down here. Um, the air flow is going up in this way, actually more upwards. So this pot here is probably quite dry. This pot here may be a bit dry. It really depends on how long this has been going on for. And if you have any mulch, if the greenhouse has been covered at all, because as we know, the sun hits the top of the, the soil here and helps evaporate that water. So there's so many factors here, and I can't say whether or not you should or shouldn't do this, but what you shouldn't do is overwater your figs. Um, the dormant trees, they need a little bit of water, but if you overwater them and you keep watering them, um, I would say give them maybe four ounces of water every two months if you wanna be safe. For me, like I said, I haven't given them anything for years, and they seem to be fine. Uh, on the flip side, I've seen people who've watered them too much throughout dormancy and they've killed all their trees. I mean, hundreds of trees. So um, that's my little PSA for today. Um, just get out there and water some of your dormant trees. All right, guys, take care and I'll catch you all for the next one.